Good evening. The group representing rank and file Gardaí has claimed its members are growing increasingly concerned about what it terms darker elements emerging at anti-water charge protests. But those campaigning against the new charges deny the claims and in turn are accusing Gardaí of employing heavy-handed tactics. There were no protesters surrounding water meter installers in this Dublin housing estate today, but workmen were surrounded by signs warning demonstrators to keep their distance. There have been clashes of late at some water protests. Gardaí say they've been assaulted and threatened. The social media element has now gone out of control where we have them offering rewards for the addresses of Garda members' houses. For what purposes we don't know and other elements of social media have indicated that they wish to petrol bomb guard stations. This is a very sinister thing that's occurring in Irish society and it's not fair to the members I represent because the uniform no longer protects them. It is disturbing, I think it is very disappointing. Uh, like I can understand people being upset at the charge but we certainly have to uphold the law and I hear you know, the Gardaí feeling that they're being uh, targeted. That certainly is not the way uh, we should uh, perform. <laughs> Organisers of the anti-water charge campaign have insisted that their protests are not violent. They're throwing whatever dirty tricks they can to divide the movement and people should stick together. The protests that are happening are peaceful. Yes, they're effective. Yes, they're trying to stop metering, which I think people have the, the right to stop metering in the estates that don't want metering. Um, but there's, there is not violence happening against the Gardaí. The Thornister today revealed more details about how the new water charges will work when they're announced in the coming weeks. A water support payment will be given on a quarterly basis, either through the Department of Social Protection or in the form of a tax credit. Joan Burton insisted that the water charges will be modest. Brian O'Donovan, The 5.30.